Hey boys, welcome back to some more Cricket 19 demo videos, I guess. <laughs> I had a blank of what I was going to say there, but, uh, oh jeez, I keep, I keep going, I gotta, I gotta register, but, um, regardless, in this video, as the title will suggest, I want to go through the player creation tools, um, and just sort of give you guys a little rundown of what it entails, and we'll, I'm not going to, like, spend ages trying to make a player, but we'll go through all the the options, see what's new, see what's improved, um, and yeah, just give a good little rundown. So let's go into it here. So you can manage uh, players. So all these guys, I'm assuming, can you actually, it's like mowing alley. Okay, yeah, so obviously all the licensed players, you can't actually, um, you know, uh, edit and stuff, which makes sense, but let's go create male play, obviously you can do female as well, so you've got, obviously, their identity here, which, I just, I gotta say again, like, the just the menu system and all that is so much better, like, I, I don't know, like, it's honestly, they've done a really good job, I, I feel like menus and stuff, it's, it's not a high priority, but it definitely just, it does improve the overall aesthetic and the overall look of the game, a lot, because you sp you do spend a fair bit of time in the menus, um, okay, so here you go, you can actually, this is, and this is, like, so much, I didn't muck around too much with, like, playing, uh, making players in the last game, because I'm not, I'm not good at making players, so I'm not gonna waste my time, like, pe there's talented people to do it, but even this seems, like, so much easier, so you can obviously do their identity, and then their country and all that, and then manage their teams there with, so, this seems so much simpler, like, if you're gonna, people are making the Indian squad, they can select him for India, I'm assuming, and then they can do him in the in India, the IPL, so to speak, the Indian domestic, um, for what team they would be, all that, so it seems, it seems just a lot more streamlined, I guess, so there's identity, you got the appearance, uh, which is pretty, pretty standard for these games, um, how do we, okay, there we go, we can select there, so you got the body, you can, you can change, like, literally everything, it is, it's ridiculous, I might spend some time off camera sort of trying to make my player for my career mode, um, while I've got this, because I think the demo, yeah, it'll obviously go into the real game, obviously, so I'll try to make my player, and then I can, uh, use him in the career mode, I think that should work, if I, like, upload it to the community, and then I can download it, on the PS4, but you can, there's, there's so much stuff here, like, all this stuff, like, I, <laughs> you can, you can spend hours and hours and hours trying to make players, um, proper, let's actually, one thing that I always like to check is the hairstyles, um, I feel like they've done a pretty good job at making these better over the years, but let's just have a look, I think it's one thing that always, the hairstyles and stuff, it always, um, it's the one thing that I feel like it's always tough to get right, and I've just got to, I always got to say this, dude, the, the big end games, cricket, rugby league, um, tennis as well now, like, they're so far above, like, any of the big sporting companies, player creation tools, it's ridiculous, like, you can make the players just unreal, but, um, it does look like there are a lot of different hairstyles, which is very nice. Um, how many are there? There are quite a few, which is good, you know, because, um, oh, Jesus, <laughs> you, can go, you can go retro, we might do, like, a freaking, honestly, I'm, this is actually is giving me a good idea, I might, um, I'm gonna do, like, my normal career mode, I don't know, I might do, like, a poll to see what you guys want to see, I'm think, I'm leaning towards a batting all-rounder, a batting, and then a, his all round is going to be a spin because I do like the spin bowling and then I'd like to be more of a batsman in this game. I think that's what I'm going to do. I might do a poll, but I'll probably just do that. But then I was probably going to stream when this game comes out because I actually have some time off work coming up around this. So it works out pretty well. And I'm probably going to get into like try to stream pretty consistently um, when the game releases. And I just had the best idea to do like a a retro, fast bowler, Dennis Lilly, Jeff Thompson type, just full on pace, 
got the mullet. <laughs> it's gonna be, it's gonna be good, dude. Oh man, I'm, I'm actually looking forward to that. <laughs> that should be good fun. Um, so that's, that's something I'm actually gonna do. Uh, and then you got all your accessories, tattoos. Um, oh, look how much there is here, dude. This is unreal. There's so much you can do. You can put the. You can do long sleeves. Um, wait, is this? It's confusing. Is that the tattoos? I don't even know, dude. There's so much stuff. Change all the shoes. The default shoes actually look pretty cool. They actually look like proper branded shoes, but obviously they're not. Um, oops. Let's go back into this. So we have the appearances. There's so much to do there. Personality. Okay, so this is. Oh, yeah, so it's pretty basic stuff. So you can choose, obviously, yeah, the all the stuff you would expect. Right hand, left hand, open a top order, middle order, lower order, batting style. Oh, okay, here we go. So let's go through all the styles. Um, so batting style one. I wish you could actually like. <laughs> I, I wish this last time as well that you could actually like go through the styles and see like more than just the one shot because a lot of times like. I don't know what the rest of the animations look like, dude. I want to choose, like, the one I like, but it's hard to know. Yeah, so that's one thing I wish they would sort of um, made a little bit better is you could actually, like, see all the different shots. But, you know, so there's Style 1, Style 2. Uh, pretty similar to last game. Um, sort of the flick. That's um, that's sort of like the Vera Coley type, uh, type shot. Very uh, subcontinent. Um, style 3... Very technical, very technically sound right there. Style 4. Uh, who is that? It's fairly technical, but then you got the flourish of the bat at the end. Who who bats like that? I can't think. Style 5 here. Oh, that's that's Stephen Smith for sure, isn't it? A little back and across. Full face of the bat. Okay, so you've got... So there's five, there's five different styles that you can choose from. I don't know... I'm actually not sure if this is going to be like all of the animations for batting in the game. I actually don't know. That that might be all of them. So there might only be five different, you know, set of animations for batters. Or they might have locked some of them like to certain players. I don't actually... I don't actually know about that one. But at the moment, there's five, which... um. You know, I think it's, it's pretty good. Like, when you're picking your own... When you're making your own player, obviously. The one thing I do hope... I I really hope they add this. I don't know if they can add it later. Or if it's already going to be in the game. But when you make your Karimo player... I just I just pray that you can change their batting style during the career. Because, you know... After, like, so many games... Like, it'd be nice to change it up. Obviously, that's not realistic. Don't get me wrong. Like... A player doesn't... Well, actually, I mean, sometimes players do change their, their batting style quite a bit, but I would just like to be able to cycle through them and actually test them out in-game, but we'll see if that actually comes to fruition there. Uh, batting, batting mentality, balanced, aggressive, brute. Uh, yeah, so the same as last time. Bowling, right arm, left arm. I didn't actually see, so if we go... Oh, it doesn't actually show... Um, the left-hand or right-handed animations. Okay, that's fine then. Uh, bowling arm. Let's just go right for now. Okay, let's have a look at these. So, style one here. Who is that? I don't even know, dude. <laughs> I can't... It's, it's not Cummins, is it? No. I, I don't know. Is that just like a diff? It looks pretty good, though. Regardless, it looks really smooth. Like, just the players running and pop into the crease like it looks real smooth uh style two here a real effort ball who is that it is sort of like like a colton all type action but who are like not cummins cummins doesn't really get that much into it what england players maybe like like a mark wood type i don't know um style three here this is hazelwood for sure very upright just a you know, very smooth action. Style 4? Jeez. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, boys. Oh, this is incredible. <laughs> Lasseth Malinga, are you serious? This is going to be perfect for our, our retro fast bowler. Oh, man. 
This has got me so pumped. I am definitely going to choose this style for that retro career mode. Oh, man. I'm excited. That is so sick. Obviously, they didn't get Lassus Malinga to come into the studio, but I wonder who... I wonder who did this. Like, I wonder what player came in and replicated it, because it's pretty good. <laughs> A real quality slingy action there. Style 5. Who is that? Who is that? I have no idea. Ben Stokes? No? Maybe? Style 6? That one's different. Like, all the... This is actually really cool. There's so many different bowling, and they're all different. Like, they all look very different. This one is... I don't know whose this is, either. It's like a... Sort of the old style, where you sort of cock the ball back and then go forward. Yeah, I don't know. So, they're the styles for there. I don't know. I'm not going to go through... Oh, I mean, well, let's go through the spinners as well. Uh, see how many there are here. Okay, so those two, I think they're the same as the first game. Okay, so there's only two of those. Uh, finger spin. So the lion. That's the other one. Style three. I think that's Moeen Alley, is it? So there's three of those. Um, and then same thing there. Same yes. thing. Oh, jeez. <laughs> scared me. Um, so that's cool. The last of the lingo is going to uh, gonna be hype, dude. <laughs> uh, so here we got the skills. Oh, jeez. What have I done? What has happened? Why did it just change like that? <laughs> okay. I don't even... It's a little confusing. Um, I don't... I mean, obviously, you increase them to make it better and stuff. How do we actually... How do we go across? Oh, there we go. They are. Okay. So, I mean, pretty pretty similar. Perks. Oh, Okay. Oh, geez, there's a lot of stuff there. So, we got the equipment and then the stats. Obviously, no stats at the moment. Let's... The skills, you know, skills are pretty standard, but the perks... Oh, here we go. There's... So, one, two, three... One, oh, whoops. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't know if you can have eight active at a time, but let's just go through some of these here. Okay. So, batting master... Huge increase to attacking and control skills. Control and attacking. So, it's got the little arrows there. It's got... How many is that? I can barely... I'm blind as a bat. Is that four? <laughs> um, T20 Big Slugger. Attacking shots significantly increased in T20 matches. Decreased in first class test. Okay. That's very interesting. Uh, wait. Attacking shots significantly increase in T20s. Attacking shots moderate. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool. Um, I know there was a thing like there's bronze, silver, and gold. I don't know where it says what um, rarity they are here. Fielding master, huge increase to catching skills. Probably won't be using that one. <laughs> Break it up. Fully recover cinema at the end of each session. Okay, that's... Some cool stuff here. Mystery bag, gold, hugely boosting, decreases to... Oh, man, this is so sick, dude. Um, let's just go... What? Let's just select one. What What happens here, then? Oh, they are all... Do okay. Oh, my goodness, dude. What on earth? There's so much. So, all these ones are sort of, like, set for, like, a type of match, which is cool. There's a couple of random ones as well. Um, but you got T20 one day. And it also... it's It's got a counter to it. Like, it's got a positive and a negative. So, I guess you've got to be sort of on the ball about changing them um, in accordance to what your calendar is looking like and what sort of you're trying to focus in, I guess, which is... Which is neat. You can really specialize in T20 or... Um, okay, yeah. You can even increase your spin uh, thing. Like if you're taking on like India or something in T20s. Um, dude. This is really cool. Uh, and then we got these ones. What are these? So, increases agility. Increases fitness attributes. Slightly increased to all fitness attributes. 
Uh, leadership ability. Okay, I wonder what leadership really does. That's that's interesting. Uh, reactionary, so running time, sprint speed. Increase confidence at commencement of an innings. Decrease later. Oh, man. There's some really interesting stuff here. I can't go through all of it. There's so many. What on earth? What are these? Oh, okay, okay. So these, okay. I'm assuming these... Ah, uh, whoops, I didn't mean to do that. So it looks like these ones are bronze, these ones are the silver, and then these are the gold ones. And from what we heard, you can only change the gold ones when you level up. So you've got to be pretty careful. I don't know how quick it is to level up, probably pretty early on it's pretty quick to level up, but you don't want to be stuck with like a T21 if you're going into like test matches, so that's pretty interesting. Um, but the um, the bronze and the silver, apparently you can change those whenever you like. So yeah, there's a cool little trade-off. What are these ones? Okay, so yeah, the rest of these are all the same. I'm assuming all of these eventually can be filled uh, depending on your level as a player. So that is just, that is so cool. And I'm assuming these, I don't, we'll see. I wonder if these are all unlocked at the start, because it's not like, obviously the silver ones are better than the bronze, so maybe the silver ones you have to unlock, um, but it's not like, it's not like a lot of them are like, progressively way better, so, yeah, this is, this is really interesting, this is going to make for some, uh, some heavy customization, and this is just increasing the career mode so much, dude, but that is, that is actually awesome, um, oh, wait, there are some different ones, hold up, I can't go through all these, <laughs> so wait, 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 these, are these the same? Oh, maybe they are the same, and why? Am I losing my mind? Okay, I think they... Yeah, I think they are the same, right? Yeah, I think it was just changing because I was selecting some. I think that... Let's have a look. Yeah, that, that's what it's doing because it, it, I'm selecting them. It's getting rid of some. Okay, okay. But there's so many. That's so cool. So, yeah, this is a little brief introduction into the, uh, the play creation and the perk system. The perk system is so deep. Like, there's so many stuff here, and it, it's all, like, little boosts or increase or decreases and different stuff, so you've really got to be sort of on the ball, and obviously, you can only select one, yeah, you can only select one gold one, it looks like, um, yeah, that's, that's real cool, dude, um, I'm really pumped, so hopefully you guys enjoyed this little video. Uh, you know, if you, if you guys haven't downloaded the demo, I would encourage you to download it. It's free. If you got a PC, you might as well give it a shot. It might not run on your computer, but you can always lower the settings to see if you can have a bit of a, a play around. Um, and yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Look forward to many more to come. It's going to be, it's going to be heaps, dude. In the lead up, I'm, I'm just going to be pumping out the videos because yeah, got to keep myself busy somehow. <laughs> so hopefully you guys enjoyed and I will see you in the next one.